So as a black woman growing up in a household full of um, women, black love was cooking, um, greens, yams, and calling the men to the table to eat, okay? Then as I got into my teenage years, love was listening to the Temptations, the Commodores sitting on the porch um, with melted now laters, uh, really trying to um, imagine love. Then in college it was, who saw a pretty woman? All right. So that was my myopic view of love till I got married. I was married for 18 years, divorced um, for the last three. And what I realized is that I carried that myopic view of romance into my marriage. So what love is today, it's just an understanding of your history. One, it's an awareness of who you are and who you are called to be. So you're taking these two individual people who you think are whole, but are broken, okay? And you're trying to figure you out and them out. Does that work? So what you need is the ability to listen and a space to understand. Jamal said, okay, this is a safe space, right? Most people do not go into their marriage creating that safe space for understanding and to listen and to say, yes, we all have different histories. I'm going to listen because I need to understand you from your point of view. Not that you're trying to uh, compete with each other as it, recall, as it relates to listening, but you're just trying to understand. Seek ye first to understand, right? And then to be understood. So creating that platform. So I know number one is an awareness and an understanding of who that individual is. Um, and that's what love is. If I have to say one word, it's understanding.